Morning guys, uh, Matty Mac here. So I, uh, most of you know that uh, my lead gen secret, uh, they know about that. Now I've had, um, I've been with this for quite a few months now and tried it out and followed their steps and their system and emailed every day and got my leads and things like that. And for quite a while I've had these little uh, suspicions that it's not quite what it seems. So I'm, um, quite disappointed overall for the amount of effort and time and cost and things that involve for what return you get. Now, straight off the bat, I, I want to say that I'm not saying you can't make money. Um, if you promote this to your community and you go out there and you actively promote it to other people and they join, you'll get paid for it. There's no, there's no qualm about that. Um, if you want to go out and chase customers, and get them into the system, you will make money, absolutely. But um, the promotion within their system of taking the leads and hitting the mail button and then sending it out via their system, uh, there's something not quite right about that. And I long suspected it was more like a, a list cleaning software so that when they sent it out, let me show you. Uh, let me just jump in here. So every day, you know, you send out your leads and things like that. Now there's a, a random group that gets opened and then of course they open and then when they click on their link, they go through to the landing page. Um, but I, I think it's more, if somebody opens and clicks on the link, they, their information is moved onto a really high priority list. That is a real email address. Yes. Um, that is somebody that's going to click on offers, um, you know, make money offers, things like that. So there are, they move from a more or less a cold list or a dead list onto a warm list. And that's more or less, they're using your account to filter these lists. Cause of course you can buy a list of millions and millions and millions of people, but you've got to somehow filter them and vet them. Um, and this is a way that, that we can do that. Um, I've also heard some people put sort of bad reviews on YouTube and then very soon after they put a bad review on, they start to get commissions through. Um, it's just a little coincidental. So I'm actually ready to quit this program. Um, I'll save my 30 bucks and put it into something else, uh, 30 bucks a month, not expensive at all, but for, for the work that I'm doing and the return that I'm getting, I think I can, I can personally spend 30 bucks somewhere else. But before I want it to be too rash, I want to make sure. So I'm going to conduct a little test. I'm due to send out my next email. And instead of sending out uh, the standard email or, or emailing my own product or whatever to these people, um, I'm going to make a really blatantly obvious, do not click, do not enter this sort of email, make it look very spammy. And even to the point I might just write, do not click this link. And I want to see how it differs. It should, if they are real people, they should see it and there should be no one even open the email, let alone click, click a, a dodgy looking link. It's not going to be a dodgy link. It's not going to go anywhere. It's, it's just going to go nowhere, but the fact that I want to try and make the email look a bit spammy and like a virus type thing. Um, but I want to send it through and make it, make sure nobody clicks it. And if these sorts of numbers crop up, then it would have proved my point that it is just sort of robots clicking through and it doesn't really matter what you say. Um, so that's what I'm hoping. So let's go ahead and um, check it out here. It's not going to be anything. I'm just going to write off the bat of my head, off the top of my head. But let's have a look, see. Uh, if we just do look at my affiliates here. So my downline, not very many members, a few have signed up and this is over what, five or six months. 
not very many commissions over the entire life you know 70 bucks over the entire life of it I've paid you know 10 times that not 10 times that I've paid more than that and the promo tools so we could start with a very basic promo tool but let's let's just start with something fairly straightforward so of course select your leads it's just going to send it to anyone I'm not going to send it from my I'll just send it from a straight standard the subject um, so we're going to we want to make it million last one click you know something stupid like that that doesn't make any sense obvious special link do not click like an IP address it looks kind of official uh, to put some wording in here I'm just going to do something a bit silly No one in their right mind is actually going to click this, right? And and it's not going to go anywhere. It's not going to do any damage to anyone. So I'm going to I'm not trying to be malicious to people here. I just wanted to prove this perhaps isn't quite what it seems. I'm just going to go to Google. Doesn't mean anything. That's about it. Do not click. This is a little. Do not click. This is a. Do not follow email link. So it looks like nothing, right? It's coming from a nothing email address. It's got a nothing subject line. This actually says do not click the link. 
and the click and the link if they do click it it just goes through to google it doesn't do anything anyway uh, so i'm about to send this one and i will come back and let you know what sort of um, hits we have and if it, my suspicions are right it's going to have a very similar open rate and a very similar click-through rate and that's just going to prove my point if that is the case i'm just going to um, cancel this straight away but i wanted to let you guys know anyone that is in this um, and, and by all means i want to know your thoughts and your successes too so um, on the bottom of this uh, this video uh, put your put your um, successes and failures of this Miley Gen secret as well because I want to know how everyone else is going. Maybe it was just me, uh, but I did follow their daily emailing rules and uh, it did, really didn't work for me. So uh, here we go. I'm just going to send it now and um, let me know what you think. I'm not going to send it perfect timing. I'm just going to send it all now. And we'll leave it for a day and uh, come back and see what happens. That's it. Boom. Sent. We'll come back and see the stats later. Okay, so it's the next day uh, and my Legion Secrets and I've just logged in and uh, I was really keen to find out what the stats were and lo and behold, uh, the fucking thing has been deleted. So it looks like they have deleted the message that I sent. So that was, uh, I didn't even anticipate that would happen. I thought either it would look exactly like these stats. Um, if it was real, it would sort of that none of these stats would have been opened it would have sent 3000 and nothing would have been opened but no uh, i've come into it and the whole email is gone so i sent an email there on the 6th I think it was uh, march the 6th but it's gone completely um so yeah i don't uh yeah that took me quite from left field i don't know what to expect from that uh let's just have a look and see if anything else has happened weird uh, it's current mailing no, let's see for another one still the same still the same commissions nothing's changed still the same Sorry, my uh, camera froze. Hopefully, I'm still going here. Well, there you go. Keeps a copy of the one, except the one that they want. They don't want you to send. So, they've deleted that. Uh, and I've got no stats for it. So that's it. Um, hmm. Well, as I said, it, um, I was pretty much done with this program. That was my final test to see if it was in fact legit or not. Um, I haven't, it's really not worth it for me, but uh, okay, let's not leave it there. Let's see what you guys, um, what you guys have come up with uh, with your successes and failures with this program if you guys can leave uh, some comments down below uh, I'll post this anyway and I just want your response if you've had success with it let us know that you've had success with it if you've had sort of not much luck with it as well as me um, let us know 
if you've made a video about it, leave your link to your video and let's uh, let's check out those videos, those reviews on it, because that'd be really interesting to see uh, what you guys are, are thinking about as well. That's about it. Um, yeah, I think I'm kind of speechless on that one. That, uh, I really didn't even think that was an option of him just ripping it out. But there you go. All right. As I said, go ahead, leave your comments below, and uh, let's see what you guys think.